I'll echo the sentiments of the, the previous speakers. It's great to see so many parents and community members here tonight. Uh, my name is Megan Eitoven, for those of you who I haven't met, and I am the proud parent of a first grader uh, down at the branch school. And I'm collaborating with a group of parents and community members on a slate called Time for Excellence, which stands for Transparency, Inclusion, Metrics for Accountability, and Equity. I think South Loop Elementary School is a good school. And I believe that Principal Shelton does amazing, amazing work. But I do think that we should report on that work in a different way. I think that we could report in a way to the parent body and to the community at large, whether those are members or stakeholders, in a way that's more accessible and digestible. And that will create buy-in of those strategies that everyone is so hard at work on here at South Loop Elementary. Mm -hmm. And by creating that buy-in, we're going to increase contributions, whether that's through volunteer hours or sharing professional expertise or perhaps underwriting programs. So I'd love to see um, one an example of how we might communicate differently to the community at large is through that uh, continuous improvement uh, work plan that was referenced um, by the first candidate this evening. I think it would be cool if that 24-month plan was published on our school website, split up into monthly milestones so we can all watch the progress that's happening and understand how we can contribute to those strategies that we put in place to improve our school. And I think those updates should be available, whether you're here at the LSC meeting for that monthly update, or whether you are at work, or taking care of a family member, or transporting your student from aftercare to soccer and aren't able to get here. I also would love to see those meetings be more accessible for parents. Um, perhaps we could offer childcare during those meetings, partner with an existing program like the Big Brothers Big Sisters 8th grade program or some older Girl Scout troops that might be looking to earn a badge and there could be a nice synergy or another neighborhood community group that would be willing to come in and partner with us to again get everybody included. When you're here at those meetings I'd love to see everyone have the agendas and have the reports that are being referenced even if it's not a hard copy in front of you let's get it projected on the wall. And again, if you aren't here in the room, how can we get you those updates? Why aren't we live streaming these or live blogging these or tweeting out this information to get you those updates just because you can't be in the room? That drives at our Slate's mission to be transparent, to be inclusive, to have those metrics in place, and again, that equity piece to make sure that everybody can participate. I want South Loop Elementary School to be the premier school in the city. I think our kids deserve it. And I think to get there, to get that excellence, we need to include everybody and invite everybody to be a part of it. So I ask that you vote for me, Megan Eitoven, on April 18, and support the other members of the Slate Time for Excellence, which will empower us to, to govern with those values that we set out. Thank you.